What is up, Pokepeeps and Masters? This is Russ here, Poke Russ here. We are here for the tutorial of the Dragon Ball card game. Yeah, Dragon Ball Super card game. If you're asking, wondering where I'm wearing this hat, it's because I was just doing some lucky summons on the banners for Dokkan Battle, and it's kind of warm in here, so my hair is kind of all messed up now that I'm wearing this hat. So we're going to finish this episode in this hat. So... It is a hot summer out, but let's get into this. We're gonna play this. Um, Dragon or Bandai released this little tutorial. You can download it for your computer um, and iOS to play um, to learn how to play the game. I'm, I'm super excited. Um, blah 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 blah. Please don't tell me I'm not allowed to record. And we're gonna... yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we'll accept that. Okay. So there's a shop list. What is this? Is it gonna open up stuff? Yeah, it is. It is. It is. It is. Go away. Okay. So, so these are all the things you can click on. It'll take you to the website. Here's the options. We like all this music. We're gonna keep it. We're gonna keep it in the background. And we're gonna get it straight into the battle. So the tutorial attack. There's different tutorials. We'll go over the tutorials in this episode and go from there. If you guys are hyped for this, if you guys want to learn how to play DBZ, DBS, actually DBS card games, hit that like and subscribe button, and we'll get into this. I am parched. This is like my third or... Actually, this is my fourth video I'm recording right now. Okay, so, my opponent and me both have... Um, so this is a charge phase. Main phase. Okay, wow, that goes by really quickly. Okay, playing cards allows you to play cards into your battle area. Let's play some cards from your hand. To do this, you switch cards equal to the required energy to rest. To play T or to play Goten, you must switch two cards to rest mode, including one blue. So we're gonna summon, select energy. Um, we're going to select select. Confirm. So where does energy come from? It should show it should show us on the screen, but I, mean, I might have I've missed it. Battle cards can attack as soon as they are played. With this in mind, try attacking with Sun Gotan. Okay, so our energy should be... Our energy... Where's our energy? This is our life. We have 5 life. Uh, 38 cards left in deck. Oh, it's just showing us our energy here. Okay, so each turn you get to charge a card from your hand as energy. It's just going to keep it off screen to show us like that. So we're going to attack. Let me attack. We're going to attack... Oh, this is kind of cool. Nice dragging. We're going to attack into Chompa. Is that what we want to do? Do we want to attack into this guy? Okay. Battling cards. During battles, you prepare the power of attacking and defending cards to determine who the victor is. The attacking side power is the same or greater than the defending side. The attacker wins and KOs the defending card. So we're going to tap our Goten to attack. We, we beat our opponent because we are the same as our opponent. Attacker always wins. So we beat Pooh Bear, winning the Pooh Bear. He goes to the drop zone. And you can, you can attack with the remaining battle cards as well. So we're going to attack. Okay. We're going to drag this and attack into Chompa. Uh, battling leader, the attack, attack an opponent's leader to win and deal damage to the opponent's life. So we're going to attack Chompa. 1,500 beats... 10,000. Or 15,000 beats 10,000. I can't count. Reduce your opponent's life to zero, and the leader card and the leader can attack. Your leader card can attack two. So we can attack with our leader card. Okay. We're gonna drag this and attack with our Goku. So Super Saiyan God's effect activates. I get to target one of my tapped cards, and I think that's what it does. We have the card right here. When your when this card attacks, choose up to one of your blue and uh, switch it to active. So we're gonna select you and confirm. So now we have four energies. It allows us to play counters if we had any in our hand. So we just, his life is down to two. We can probably win next turn. To end your turn, you can't do anything else at this point, so let's end your turn. So we'll hit this next button. So it goes over the bases, like, it gets into the real nitty gritty of the game. My opponent has two cards in hand. 
or he had two cards in the hand, he draws a third. So when things look bad, your leader can awaken. So since my opponent has four or less, he gets to draw two cards and flip over his leader card. So it is now awakened, his Z awakened. It is Gokon awakened. It's ready. He's gonna tap. He's gonna tap for hit. Hit's gonna attack into our Goten. Since his power is equal to ours. Oh. So he's gonna attack into us. Now when um, when, when Chompa's effect is when he attacks, he draws one card. And see, since he does life damage, deals life damage to us, we get to draw the card that he does in damage. Um, life is eight cards you set aside, and you will get them. So when you take life damage, you add the card to your hand from each point you take it. The music is super loud. Hopefully it's not loud in the video. Um, I should have probably checked that. I'm going to turn it down just a little bit even more. Okay. So, a player of opponent is finished. It looks like he doesn't have a blocker. Is this a blocker? So we, we can draw and charge a card. All of our stuff comes untapped. Okay, so we are down to four, so we can awaken. What's this card do? Can I look at it? No, I can't, okay. We're gonna awaken. So we have four or less, we can draw two cards and flip this card over. So we got four cards in hand. Awesome. So this card gains plus five thousand because we have five card or five energy or more. And let's attack the leader with the awakened card. You're not gonna allow me to summon anything? Okay. We'll attack the leader. He attacks, he has double strike. Double, I believe. Okay, so we draw one card. And he uses okay. So he uses the blocker ability. So a, cards with blocker can forcibly redirect the target's attacks to themselves, which is really nice. Looks like I picked a good spot for the uh, webcam, because there's not too much going on. I guess the other place I can put it is over here by the main phase. But I think we did a good job here. Um, bring your main phase, we can play other cards from a hand. So we don't, just because we attack doesn't mean it's already over. So we're going to evolve now. We're going to evolve Rapid Sun Goku into God Rush Sun Goku. So we're gonna play this. We're gonna play this over this. Is that how we wanna do it? Yep. We're going to evolve. So some things cost less when it, when you go to evolve them. So this one costs three or I don't know how many it costs. Oh five and three of them have to be blue. Okay, so we confirm, we tap all five, and we place it over the specified card. When you put this card into play, choose all of Okay. The effects in this game do happen a little fast, so we're going to attack into Chompa here. We're going to attack with... I, I love that animation, though. It has double strike, so we get to do two damage straight to Chompa. So, double strike means it allow, is allowed to do two damage of life after winning the game. Or winning the battle, sorry. So, 2,500 is stronger than 15. Boom. And we are victorious. As soon as you reduce your opponent's life to zero, they do lose. Okay, so that's a tutorial attack. We can do a tutorial combo. We're gonna do, we're gonna do a couple of these. We'll do a couple more of these in another video. Um, let's knock out let's knock out the first. Let's see, there's six. We'll knock out the first three. We'll knock out the first three. Ah, maybe we'll split this into three. We'll knock out the first two, so you guys get it more in depth. So let's begin this battle tutorial. So now we've seen the basics of the game, now we get to learn about combos. So combos is the, the meat and potatoes in this game. So my opponent's going to attack. In the battle step there is an offense step, a defense step, and a damage step. So during the offense step, my opponent is allowed to uh, activate combo cards to and skills during this time. So combo cards are cards you set you, you can play with your energy to make your uh, other creatures stronger as a team. So he doesn't play any. Now I, in the defense step, I get to do the same thing. 
once the defense steps over, uh, we compare the powers. So about comboing, let's use a combo to raise our card's attack power and defend against attack. Spending one er spend by spending one energy, you can use um, God Rush Sun Goku card in your hand to combo. So we're gonna combo this, I believe we just set it here, and we just tap one of our cards. Um, by using combos, you add the combo power written on the cards cards participating in the combo power, which is on the side here. You can't really see it because of the uh, the animation thingy. But since uh, since God Thrust and Goku is, uh, combo power is 10,000, using combo gives uh, Soul Striker a total of 2,500. So that means we beat his 2,000. That means he does not do any life damage. Um, is it all we're doing? Oh, next. Gotcha. So 2,500 versus 2,000. We win the battle. His card is def his damage is deflected. At the end of the battle, any cards used in a combo are sent to the drop area. So you get to use the combo for one person and one person alone. It doesn't last the entire turn. But he's going to attack with... He's going to use card his God of Destruction effect, draw one card. His offense step. He's going to power himself up with 5,000 making him 2,000. Now we're going to use our Piccolo to do the same thing. Some, card, some cards cost zero to use, which is super nice. They do have, um, there they are weakened power, but we get to do that. So we're going to do that. We're going to, we're going to play it. We're going to press confirm. It's free. And we get to add, there's no energy to participate in this combo, which is super nice. We're going to also use one of we can also use one of our cards in the active area if we want to to use as a combo, but it will be discarded afterwards. That is kind of the downside, but it, we, we get the we get the boost. We get the boost, and we're going to hit next. So you can use any card that's active or in your hand as a combo bonus, but then those cards will be discarded at the end. It's super nice. It's super fun. Okay. It's my turn. It's time to take out um, my opponent. So at the start of your turn, all of your rest cards become active. Main phase, you can play... Okay, blah, 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 blah. you're moving too fast. There are no cards in your hand. Help with your attack in your opponent's sleep... Or blah, blah. There are no cards in your hand. Help with your attack in your opponent's sleep. At times like this, you may use uh, combos to power up. Um, so we're going to strike at my opponent. No. Okay, so we got we got to strike at my opponent here. So we're attacking with a weaker creature. We're going to use this. Uh, we need to pay one card. Confirm. So we'll get plus ten thousand, making twenty thousand. Now my opponent is allowed to counter the defense step. But he doesn't play anything, so we overpower him and we do one life to him. Okay, so now we can attack with our Goku card. Our powers are equal, so we should win. When we when we attack, we do draw two and we do select up to two of our mana that is tapped and untap it. Has to be blue mana though. I like calling it mana. Okay, so we're going to, since you need to do more damage to win, let's um, use the cards in your hand to combo, so that your opponent can't combo their own to defend against it. So we're both equal, but if my opponent defended, he would win, and then we would, couldn't win. We couldn't win this match. So we're going to play, we're going to play this, we're going to play one, it doesn't matter which mana we tap, we're also going to play this, we're pretty much going to go with all out, all out in this attack, because this is, this is the game winning attack. We're 3,000 power, my opponent has to do 1,500 more. Uh, he only has one card in hand, so that almost promises us that we've won. Yep, so you can only do 2,500. And we do the life of damage, and we win. Victory! Victory is ours. Okay, your opponent ran out of life. Sweet. Okay, so that is how we do combos. Um, we'll go more in depth in this in the next episode. We'll take on the tutorial on dry or extra cards, 
and the blocking tips. So we'll do those two in the next episode, and we'll do the last two in the pre in the following episode. We're probably going to do this maybe, I don't know how I'm going to upload these, but we're going to start on Saturday and upload these, and we'll see where it goes from there. If you guys like this kind of content, if you guys love learning about DBC Super, if you guys like the DBZ content, DBZ Month, all of that, I will see you in the next episode. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, have a great day. Pokeros, out. Bye.